Akio. There you guys are. Hello, wizarding friends, and welcome back to my channel, Akio Katie Black. It is a pleasure to see you guys again today. So today, I have something very, very cool for you. So I received a lovely package in the mail from my mom. Um, she wouldn't tell me where it was from, and then when I got it, I realized who it was from. So she ordered me, LitJoy had a sale, and she ordered me some goodies for LitJoy. So I was able to find a little box for you just to kind of give you a nice little sneaky peek. There we go. All right, so let's go ahead and get started and see what we have now. I will tell you, I did open the one item already just because I didn't want to rush on camera and I didn't want it to rip because it does have a wax seal on it and I quite think, I, I like the wax seals. They're very pretty. So first, Let's start out with this very cool bookmark. We are only as strong as we are united and as weak as we are divided. So it has all four houses represented. Um, so this side has Gryffindor and Ravenclaw and then Slytherin and Hufflepuff. Um, and I like that they didn't do like the Gryffindor and Slytherin on one side. I just, I like that they broke it up this way. Um, we'll go with the Potter Watch pin next. This is by Oddment and Tweak for LitJoy Crate. Um, it's a beautiful pin and I, it does spin. Hopefully you guys can see this. Hang on. And it lands on Albus, Sirius, and Moody's names. Um, it's a beautifully done pin. And I, I'm really, really happy with it. It's gonna go on this thing. I don't know if you guys can still see this, but um, this is sort of a spoiler for the August Accio box. I've already put it up, so sorry. Next up is this bad boy. So the backer card is Albus Dumbledore's Will. Herein is set forth the last will and testament of Albus Percival Wolfric Brian Dumbledore. Um, and it is the snitch that he gave to Harry. And on the front of the pen engraved, it says, I open at the close. And then when you open it, it has the, uh, the stone of re resurrection in there. So it does open. It's a beautiful pen. I cannot wait to put it in my little pen holder that I've got. Next up, we have a night bus ticket, which I think is really, really cool. It's lovely gold foiling. I love this purple. And then a platform nine and three quarters ticket as well. I think it is simply, simply stunning. I like how, I don't know, it's just so, I don't know, it just screams like Hogwarts. Like I just, I think this is definitely the way that you would be, you, like this is the ticket you'd be given. Issue subject to the rules and regulations of the Hogwarts Express Railway Authorities. Whoever did these did a really good job. They're beautiful. So we are coming up to the, let me see, we're going to do this next. So I, as you can tell from my last name on, on YouTube and on my Instagram, I love the Black family. I just, I don't know. I don't know what it is that kind of brought my attention to them. Um, it is not my real last name. Sorry. I just didn't want to use my last name. Um, so I, I guess she got me knowing that. She got me the, uh, the house family, the black family tapestry, which I think is really, really cool. Um, so let's see, it's got Sirius and Andromeda blasted off. Um, Narcissa and Bellatrix is on here. Dorea. I just, I think these tapestries are beautiful, and I know that, um, 
Oh, the people who did like all the props and stuff. Uh, Mina Lima. They have wallpaper that you can get that's Black Family Tapestry. And I swear if it were up to me, it would be all over one wall of my library. Just saying. <clears throat> so next up on the list, it came in this beautiful envelope. And this is the mar the thing I was telling you about, the um, wax seal. And it is a invitation for the Slughorn's Christmas party that he hosted. Um, these paper replicas are simply beautiful. And I know that some people have issues with the paper replicas that they're not neat or whatever, but I, I love them. I think it's something that's kind of tangible that, you know, you can hold on to. Um, I kind of want to make some howlers and like hang them from the ceiling. Like, I'm not even kidding. I think that paper stuff is just so, I don't know. It just makes it feel more real, I guess. That's a weird way of putting it, but yeah, a little bit, you know, more real. I am going to save the envelope because I just, I think it's beautiful. They aren't going to go there permanently, but they're going to go there for right now. In this neat little box, and as Cherry always says, good things come in small boxes. So I wasn't really sure what to expect. Like I knew that they had some necklaces and whatnot and some, you know, jewelry bits and some small things that were up during their sale because I did look at it. I just didn't buy anything. And I got the Slytherin Locket. So on the card that was inside, to the Dark Lord, I know it will be dead long before you read this, but I want you to know that it was I who discovered your secret. I have stolen the real Horcrux and intend to destroy it as soon as I can. I face death in the hope that when you meet your match, you will be mortal once more. R-A-B, which as we now know stands for Regulus Arcturus Black. Um, the locket actually does open. does open so I would I mean I would imagine you could put you know somebody's name in it or picture or something in it if you wanted to um, and it is completely wearable so let's see we'll put it on Ta -da! So this box is actually the box that this next item came in and I cannot believe that she ordered me this. Um, it was one of the pieces that I just sat there and stared at and was trying to figure out if I could make it happen um, financially and I just couldn't and I was bummed out and it was like she could read my mind and knew exactly what I wanted. So as you can tell, yes, this is a light box get to my laptop and see if I can't. Get it plugged in. So you guys can see it. Haha. Okay. So it is a light box. And it is this one. It is beautifully done. It's in beautiful details. I just... Hogwarts will always be there to welcome you home. I just... And there's Harry in his pajamas with his crazy messy hair. And I just... I love this design. I think it is stunning. The other one that they had was really, really pretty as well. I can't remember what it was, but it was really nice. Um, I just, I'm so happy that she was able to get me this and I am going to have it displayed, uh, somewhere nicely for our next, for my next video, which will be next week. Now, come on. 
uh, that is the end for my LaJoy items from my mom. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching me unbox these and kind of take them out. Um, I think if I had to pick, my favorite item probably is the locket. Um, while the movie one is nice, this one's more modeled after the book one. And I think that it's, I don't know, I just think it's very pretty. Um, and the fact that you could open it and put something in it is really nice. Um, second to that, I think, would have to be the two pins. I, I think they're beautiful. Um, I think that they're very important to, you know, the last part of, you know, the Potter franchise and the last, you know, book and movie and stuff. And I just, I think they're great pieces to have. So you'll see those up there um, next week for our next video. Now, next week will be the September... August. The August Accio box. Sorry, I forgot what month we were in. <laughs> Grad school will do that to you, in case you were wondering, because pro you probably saw the classes back there. Um, I am in graduate school getting a master's in mental health counseling and clinical rehabilitation. Um, so that's what's, I don't even know what month it is. It's fine. Um, so it is the August Accio box and it's the common room theme. Um, so look out for that next week. Uh, I am very excited to show you the items. They're very cool. So, I hope all is well, and I will see you guys next week. Bye!